heavyweight champion, Jerry the King Lawler. Jerry the King Lawler, the white clad champion with the blue and gold and white crown. It's the world belt, ready to go against Caroline Eric in a double or nothing belt situation. Listen, Mark, why don't you be quiet for just a minute? Let me tell you about Jerry Lawler. He's the greatest champion that ever put on a pair of wrestling boots. He's no company champion. You know, when he won his first world heavyweight belt, which happened to be the AWA belt, he challenged everybody. He put the belt up and he challenged everybody. He challenged Hulk Hogan. He challenged Ric Flair. He challenged them all. Nobody accepted the challenge except Kerry Von Eric, and ha, he whipped Kerry. Now look, Kerry's had so many shots at Lawler's title, it makes me sick. It's embarrassing. He cannot beat Jerry Lawler. Jerry Lawler is the greatest wrestler who ever came down the pike. And I'm looking forward to him walking out of here being the Texas heavyweight champion tonight, Mark. Is that your lecture for the evening? When's the exam, Professor? I'm just wanting to tell you, you know, sometimes we forget. We don't well, mix. You've it. forgotten a lot. We don't mix it how great Jerry Lawler is. Gentlemen, it's the Texas champion in this double or nothing belt situation. The modern day warrior, Kerry Von Eric. Uh, as I was trying to say before Terrence interrupted, the winner of this bout takes both the world title and the Texas title with him. It's double or nothing. Here comes the Texas champion, Kerry. The modern day moron, huh, Mark? You know, I don't think Kerry Von Eric could beat Jerry Lawler if Kerry had a gun, Mark. Shots at this belt, and he's never taken the gold off Jerry Lawler, nor has anyone else. Jerry Lawler is the greatest wrestler, bar none. He's beat the Hulk Hogan, he's beat the Rick Flair, he's beat them all. They've all come down to fight Jerry Lawler. So, what? One win. Jerry Lawler, I'm telling you, nobody compares to his one and loss record. He's the greatest. You know, since it's close to Christmas time, I wanted to bring you all a present tonight. I wanted to get something that all of you need, but I didn't know how to wrap up a bathtub. So I didn't bring anything. Oh yeah. You know, he is a witty human being too. You know, he, his mind, he's a brilliant man, Mark. And you are an unusual one. All right, Jerry Lawler with his crown and belt. We're ready to get the bout underway as... As Kerry has words with Lawler and then is moved away by referee Tony Falk. A USWA main event here, double or nothing. Not often you see this situation where the winner takes not one but two coveted title. Well, that belt looks great around Jerry Lawler's waist. I don't think, it's never been around anyone else's waist. It's used to his waist size. <laughs> he's so proud of that belt as well he should be. Like I said, he's not a company champion. He's the people's champion. Oh yeah, he, he wants the mic again, Mark. Don't hand it to you him. You know, Kerry, I told you that when I win that little rinky-dink Texas title, I'm gonna take it up to Tennessee and I'm gonna drop it in an outhouse and I'm gonna, after I do, I'm gonna give you a map and tell you the exact location because you're the only idiot I know that would crawl down in an outhouse to get that Texas belt. <laughs> you heard that, didn't you, Mark? Well, that's your champion for you. That shows you the kind of class that is being represented. All right, here we go. Jerry Lawler against Kerry Von Erich. Some green tights and the girls give him a hoot and here we go. The bell sounds. Double to nothing title. World title and Texas title underway with the United States Wrestling Association. Like I was saying before, Jerry Lawler's not a company champion. He's the people's champion, don't, Mark. Don't hand it. And one other thing, Kerry Von Eric, you bring these little sleeve bags out here around the ring. Close. Boy, you think Brian would have just been I didn't have anything to do. Put him up to that. I didn't have anything to do with that. Low class. It's low class. That's what it is. Huh. Jerry's trying to talk. disqualify him right now. What's the matter with him? Is he nuts? You 
bring these little sleaze bags out here trying to distract me. Well, I got news for you. The girls up in Tennessee's rear end would make them a Sunday face. That's what I said. They're hogettes. They're not rangettes. <laughs> you heard it from the champion, Mark. He agrees with me. Kerry Von Erich anxious to get to Lawler. Had to be backed away by Tony Fox, and the count is started again. So Lawler will have 40 instead of 20 to get in since he had to go back and start over again. He'd gotten up to about 16. He's not anxious to get at Lawler. He's shaking in his boots. He knows he's going to leave here not a champion. He's going to leave here a challenger again, Mark. And the two lock each other up in the referee stance, and they're back in the corner. Lawler wanting it broken, and delivers a right. What a right hand. Jerry Lawler's got the best punch in wrestling. It's not the most legal thing in the world, but it sure does work. Tell you what, Kerry Von Erich has never looked better, if you ask me. He looks sensational, and he is into this bout, and he's particularly angry at Lawler now. Are you saying that the champ doesn't look wonderful? Are you saying he's not in great shape? Look at it. I didn't say that. Barrett said Perry spins with a surprise discus punch to knock Lawler on his asteroids. He's using the fist, Mark. Von Eric used the fist and he punched Jerry Lawler right in the face. That's illegal. Come on, Buck. Call it like it is. Barrett, you're going to have to settle down. If you're going to stay out here, you're going to have to settle down. This Von Eric brings out the worst in me, Mark. You know, he comes out here, he tries to embarrass me on national television last week. I hope Lawler beats him to death. Is that when he called you a fruitcake? Out to the floor they go. Here's Kerry spinning with a discus right. Down goes Jerry Lawler on the ringside floor. Pink chair again, don't hit Garvin. Kerry trying to get a retaliation for the chair, the uh, chain earlier, but the referee won't allow it, has taken it away from him again. Here's another chair, and Garvin is interfering now by grabbing the chair. Kerry wants to nail Garvin, but Tony Falk pulls him off again, and folks, I'm embarrassed by this Garvin situation. Here's Lawler with some sort of white glove he's pulled out of his tights. I can't believe this, Mark. This is the most atrocious thing I've ever seen. Von Eric comes out here. He's gotten my chair twice. He's trying to hit Jerry Lawler with a chair. I'm going to call for an investigation. This is horrible. Well, that's a Lawler's elbow pad that he's got something in that he's using on Kerry, and this is totally out of control. Kerry keeps coming at him. He's getting my chair. He couldn't whip Lawler if he had my chair, Mark. Garvin, you're in hot water now. I suggest you hush. Better yet, leave. Tony Falk trying to figure out what's going on now. He's threatening to run Lawler out of here. Von Eric thinks he's so smart. He's going to get his. Jerry Lawler's going to get him. I'm telling you, boy, I'm so hot over this, I can't stand it, Mark. Well, we can't stand you either. Here's Lawler wanting to put Kerry in the DDT. That's beautiful. That was a DDT, and Kerry's gone. Champion again, right there. That's the champion, I'm telling you, Mark. One, two, Kerry says no. <laughs> Kerry now. This all got out of hand when Lawler pulled the chain out and then tossed it to Terrence Garvin, who's got it hidden somewhere. And now Lawler is using his elbow pad that he's got something in and maybe a steel plate or something. No, there's no steel plate in there. That's just Kerry Lawler's big right fist. That's all it is. Kerry can't beat Lawler. He's tried to hit him with the chair twice. Huh. This is, I'm telling you, Mark, Kerry Lawler's going to teach Kerry Von Eric a lesson, and I can't wait. I have never been so angry and frustrated in this chair in nine and a half years. And I apologize for what is sitting next to me and what is happening. Yeah, I've never been so appalled myself. Kerry Von Eric keeps coming out. Well, he's more worried about me than he is. Hey, he's got Lawler over in the corner, Mark. He's got him in the corner. Lawler's trying to block it by grabbing Tony Fox legs. Kerry trying to pull Lawler back out. Lawler holding on to Tony Fox. Lawler's the smartest man in the business. I, I guarantee it. 
see you that. He's going to take care of Von Eric, Mark. Harry has to get back in the ring before he's counted out. Lawler again using that elbow pad. That's just padding the blow. That's all that's doing. He doesn't want to break the rules by hitting him with a fist, so he's hitting him with his elbow pad, Mark. Jerry the King Lawler doing something that may be a choke. There's no telling what's what it is. What's Falk doing? What's Falk doing? He's pulling Jerry Lawler by the hair. Let him fight, man. Von Eric started this thing. Let Lawler finish it. Lawler with another shot, and the referee checking on Kerry Von Eric. Big shot by Kerry to knock Lawler back out of the corner. What a punch that was, Mark. I felt it down here. I'm telling you. Oh, man. He just hit the king again, Mark. We're right with you. As Kerry with the pin, one, two, and a leg in the rope will stop that. Oh, man, I'm so excited. I just can't hardly stand it, Mark. He's going for the iron claw. Jerry Lawler's got it blocked, though. Falk needs to, he needs to make him break. Lawler's under the ropes over there. The iron claw is on, and Lawler's trying to climb the ropes to get out of it. Make him break, Falk. He's in the ropes. Come on, do your job, buddy. And Kerry Von Eric getting frustrated with the referee. Boy, you know, Kerry's done everything that he can do to try and get through this with Lawler. That's the iron claw in the midsection on Jerry the King Lawler. He's tried three times, two times to hit my chair. Mush, Terrence. Kerry has picked Lawler up over his shoulder with the iron claw in the midsection and knocks him back down, still maintaining the claw. fortitude Jerry Lawler's got to be able to withstand that iron claw and still come back. He's not finished yet, Mark. I guarantee you he's not finished. Kerry and Lawler still at it. Kerry holding on to the headlock. And Lawler turns Kerry and throws him into the referee. Lawler with a low blow on Von Eric. Yes, sir, buddy. Here we go. This is Jerry Lawler's kind of match. Oh, no. Kerry moved out of the way. And now Three of them are out you know, of it. Kerry, Kerry, I'm going to do something for Kerry. I'm going to help Kerry. He wants my chair, Mark. I'll tell you what I think I'll do. I think I'll give him my chair. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Terrence Garvin had Jerry Lawler his chair. What, what is the matter chair, with buddy. you? I'll give it. Oh, no. Lawler got the chair. I didn't mean for that to happen, Mark. I didn't mean for him to get my what, chair. What is going on? Tried to help a Von Eric in it, 